Harry Kane struck a stoppage time winner as England beat Tunisia 2-1 in Volgograd to win their opening match at a major finals for the first time since 2006. Kane had opened the scoring after 11 minutes as Gareth Southgate's side dominated the first half only to concede a 35th-minute penalty for Kyle Walker's challenge on Fekardine Ben Yusuf which for Johnny Sassy converted. England laboured after the interval and looked to be heading for a draw before Kane converted a smart near-post header to earn a win which puts them level on points in Group G with Belgium, who beat Panama 3-0 earlier in the day. England's lineup was as anticipated with Southgate opting for a 3-5-2 system and Harry Maguire ahead of Gary Cahill as the third centre-back with Ashley Young edging out Danny Rose in the left wing-back role. Fans react to the moment Harry Kane won it for England they started with face and purpose, scything through Tunisia almost at will with Jesse Lingard forcing Tunisia goalkeeper Muez Hassan into a smart save with his left foot before Raheem Sterling fluffed a glorious chance, failing to sort his feet out with a goal at his mercy and bundling a shot wide. England continued to create chances and took the lead when John Stones met Ashley Young's corner with a superb header which Hassan did brilliantly to claw away but Kane was on hand to turn home the rebound. Reuters, Hassan was forced off with an injury and replaced by Farouk Ben Mustafa with 15 minutes gone. He was just as threatened as his predecessor. Jordan Henderson tested him from a long range before Lingard fired tamely wide when unmarked from a young cross. Tunisia equalized against the run of play when Walker caught Ben Yusuf with a stray elbow in the box. AP, Southgate and his players protested the decision, especially given Kane was repeatedly being held in the penalty area at corners, but Colombian referee Wilmar Rolden was unmoved and Sassy beat Jordan Pickford from 12 yards. Still the chances came England's way with Stones and Lingard going close before the latter hit the post on the stroke of halftime. Reuters, the intensity and invention drained out of England's play in the second half. Kane was again tightly marked, to say the least, at set pieces but their threat receded, prompting Southgate to replace Sterling with Marcus Rashford in the 69th minute. Ruben Loftus-Cheek was introduced for Ali 11 minutes later but it was Kane who made the breakthrough, sparking jubilant scenes at full time. Kane among the top scorers at the World Cup 2018